Hello dear friends, in trick number 323, I am going to discuss a very important LCM based statement problem. Yes, the concept of LCM will be used to solve this statement problem. A very common problem for all competitions and students at class 5, 6 level, they start studying these kind of problems when they study LCM uh, in their syllabus. Now the problem which I am taking up goes like this. Now there are three traffic lights and they change after a definite interval of time. So the first traffic light is changing after an interval of 18 seconds. The second one after an interval of 72 seconds. The third one after an interval of 108 seconds. Now if they change together at 9 am, so what happened at 9 am? They changed together. So we need to find out at what time will they change together again. So a very important question. So you must first identify that the question is based on finding LCM of the numbers. Why? Because obviously 18, 72 and 108 seconds they are taking to change. So your answer will be greater than these three numbers because uh, they will be changing in subsequent time. So whenever your answer is greater than the given numbers, then the concept of LCM is uh, to be used. So what we do is for this, we take the LCM of 18, 72 and 108. Now how do you find the LCM of these three numbers 18, 72 and 108? Now see traditional method will consume a lot of time. So you need to know little bit of the basics of finding LCM. If you know the small tricks of finding LCM, then I think this problem will be very easy for you. And students who have practiced those small tricks, one of the tricks I have used in my trick number 50. So you can see this trick of finding LCM through a shortcut on the on the channel trick number 50 so i am using this trick number 50 to find the lcm of 1872 and 108 now what do you do in this case see 18 is a perfect factor of 72 because 18 fours are 72 so 18 is a divisor of 72 so whenever we have a divisor of a given number in the set of numbers then we don't require to consider the divisor so 18 is omitted from our consideration and we have to just find the LCM of 72 and 108. Now see 72 does not divide 108 obviously. But if you take multiples of 108, next multiple is 216. So 72 into 3 is exactly 216. So this 216 is the LCM of the 3 given numbers. So you see how much time I have taken to find the LCM. No traditional method like prime factorization method has not been used here. So it takes only 3 seconds to arrive at this 216 and now you can gather your answer very easily. At what time they will change together again? They will change together again after 216 seconds. Now if you convert that into minutes, obviously 216 is 180 plus 36, uh, this 180 is 3 minutes and 36 seconds. So they will change. If they have changed together at 9 am, then the next change will be at 903 am and 36 seconds. This is the time when they will change together again. So students, a very important problem for LCM and you need to learn this shortcut by doing trick number 50 on the channel. So if you like it, share it and subscribe the channel.